what do you think happened with North Turner? Can you suss it out? Uh, I, I just think that's a, a difference in philosophies. Like, what's the, what's the, what, but it's not as if they're going to go five wide, right? Or, right? It's no, not as I if they're going to open. What, what can they do? Uh, the Vikings are who they are. Are they not? Uh, yes. And, and they, I mean, they lost their tackle. We had this conversation. You have, you have a quarterback. Remember way back before they started winning a couple of games, the, the one question was when everyone was saying they're better off with, without Bridgewater, like, are they really? That offensive line is not the strongest. Then you lose your guy. Now you lost Adrian Peterson. You have a quarterback in the last few weeks. After Philly, what happens? They went to Philly. They know him. Okay? The, the players, you game plan an offense. You've heard me say this, but you play the player. They knew the player. And they got in his face. They blitzed through the A-gaps. They kept him in the pocket, gave him trouble. Last week, that's the same thing. Just rushing four, what did they do? They pushed the pocket. They kept him in, kept him just with their their um, defensive ends, kept Sam Bradford in the pocket. And once he gets hit in the beak a couple of times, he starts to see ghost. That's been his M.O. throughout his career. It's it it showed. You don't there's you know, your your offensive line is what it is. Your run game is what it is. And from a receiver standpoint, they're still trying to get guys out there. Okay, you, you you went into the draft, but that you know your rook's not on the field. He's not. Uh, Cordero Patterson is now covering kicks. Okay, so you have Stephon Diggs. It's not a lot, and people. It's, that's what happens in this league. That's what's happening to Wentz. That's what the Dax somewhat is starting to show. Guys start to say after a while, okay, this is all you're doing. Do something else. So how's it going to look different with Shermer? Well, there's a comfort level with I don't know if it's I don't know if, how different you can make it look. There's a comfort level there with Shermer and um, Bradford. Uh, but as far as uh, you're right, as far as switching the offense out, I, I don't see them doing all of that. Because first is, of all, that's not Zim. That's not Zim's. You know, that, that that's not his mindset to, to go out. Zim wants to run the ball and play good defense. That, that's his mindset. So I don't. And which is what Nor North Turner likes to do that as well. Right. So I don't under, I don't They're understand. They're from the same cloth. So it has, They're it, both from the Dallas era. It has to be. I mean, it, obviously, it's got to be. If, if if there's nothing personal going on with North, because yeah. it can always that's that's the first thing whenever something like this happens. I'm always wondering, is there something going on with the family? Because that supersedes everything. Sure. If you have to walk away for, for that reason. If that's not the case, then it's a personality thing. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.